Hello everyone, in this short tutorial I'm going to show you how you can create your own menus. In this case you need uh, the Airtables Manager, you have to click in here and uh, name it like uh, My Octopus Menu. Let's create it, okay. Now we have our totally empty buttons. Now we can start using the actual browser, for example this one. And if you want to create a new menu and you want to fill it with actions, then you have to type in, for example, group grouping. Uh, and it's going to filter you all the available group uh, actions. For example, group attach, and just simply drag and drop each action onto your buttons. Open, close. And if you don't want to use all of the available actions, you can even move your actions by simply drag and drop them from one button to the other. And now we can save it, just like that. Uh, as you can see, the colors are not really cool in here, so since we have to save our button, we can move into another. And we can copy the color, copy the icon color, layout, animation, behavior, and shadows. And we're gonna copy all these available commands, and we're gonna paste it onto our newly created Octopus menu. As you can see, now all the colors and everything you can uh, see uh, on the available um, menu has been pasted onto our newly created menu. Now you can simply save it, and in theory, uh, now you can see it inside the hotkey editor. Now let's start my Octopus menu, here it is. And now we can bind whatever uh, hotkey we want to use. A simple action, just for example, Shift G, for example. Okay, perfect. Assign, save, and let's hide it. And as you can see, it's, it's been created and it's working. So, if we're creating a box, copying it, and that's Group it in, perfect, it's working. And group, also it's working perfectly. So this is how you can create your own menus. It's pretty easy. Happy modeling.